Hey guys, it's me, Houston. Welcome to the groundbreaking ceremony. You know, as you all know, the wooden Kids Kingdom playscape that was constructed in 1995 uh, survived 28 years until uh, February 2023 whenever we decided as a city that it needed to uh, be taken down. And as you know, the old playscape was not ADA compliant whatsoever. So we're excited when it was discussion, hey, we need to replace this. Uh, city council led the charge say, you know, we need to replace it. Mayor Dodgen said, let's be sure that, that it is inclusive for all. The playscape that's gonna be installed will have rubberized surfacing. So if you're in a wheelchair, you're in a walker, you're even elderly and walking on the cane, you can get around and all the play elements are at ground level. So you don't have to climb stairs to get on a slide and slide down. Uh, there's individual play stations for you in a wheelchair, you're in a walker to go around and do things with your friends. Well, I've had the opportunity to work with Jack and his team um, over the years. Um, so to be able to parlay on the uh, most recent Bauer Park, where we created an inclusive play space, um, the, the council and uh, the park committee asked us to see what we could do here as well. And, and the unique part about this project, and I've been involved in uh, three or four of these now, is we've replaced an older wooden playground that was built by volunteers. And that's, um, that's touchy. It's uh, extremely exciting uh, for the folks that built that park 28 years ago. Uh, but like everything else, it's time for things to go. Uh, maintenance became a nightmare. And so uh, we've been fortunate to get to put uh, a design together that the uh, council approved. And uh, we basically just took uh, what's here, the existing two to five and your existing five to 12. And it's more of a traditional type play space. And so what we did is we brought in some inclusive pieces that'll kind of bridge the two to five and the five to 12 playground through the old space where the wooden playground was. I think it's very important um, for a company to give back and you know, it, it makes the community a greater place to be in, and it makes Niagara a greater place to work. Um, having that community involvement really makes it feel like, like you're working with family. So what do you think? Why was this important to you? Because I just wanted this place to get a new playground. I just really want everybody to have more fun. Yeah, as you also know, if you've been here before, we did do a new playground in 2015, and that playground behind me, that's gonna be available as it always has been. So you can come out and play today, and over the course of the next two or three months, watch the other playground be built. So we're hoping about when school's out, be looking at the news, be looking at uh, uh, on, on social media for a grand opening of the of a new Kids Kingdom Playscape, roughly in June of this summer. <laughs>